I'm repulsed by my husband. There's no attraction left. I can appreciate that he's a very good looking person, but I'm not attracted anymore. It's been too many years of him acting like a selfish child. I don't think I can ever get it back. My therapist once told me that once you see the love bank completely empty, it's hard to ever see anything in it again. Like a jar full of pennies. When your lover does good things, it adds. When they do bad things, it takes. And when you see it completely empty, it's almost impossible to ever see it filling up again. You know what to do, friend. Nothing left here. Once the ugly heart takes over, it's hard to see attraction anymore. Absolutely. Samzies see no evil. Can we get more context? You should talk to him about this rather than tell mentally ill people on the internet. Then leave him. It's a wrap. Becky, is that you? Divorce. Find someone you are attracted to and who treats you with respect. Move on. Mating in Captivity is a great book you should read. Relationships. Especially marriages are something that need to be consistently worked on to survive. If you want to make your relationship work, then I suggest you put in the necessary work. Why is it that when I look at some of your past posts from roughly a year ago, I see you stating in the subject line of your posts that you're a 33-year-old female and your husband is a 31-year-old male you two apparently met back in 2014. But then there's another post from you where you say you're a 20-year-old female and your boyfriend is a 19-year-old male. And he threw you under the bus for burning his mother's pot handle. Thinking face. I don't know ages and children, but if a divorce is in order, it might well be early. One time, when I felt like you, the very smell of him nauseated me. Honey, is that you? This is why you can't ick people out you guys. Time to GTFO. Wife, is that you? Then leave and GTFO Reddit. Unless there is abuse. Counseling helps. Based on the small post here. The only reason you are leaving is because he is childish. That sounds. Well I'm childish especially if there are kids I hope there are not. It's time to pack up and roll if you tried talking to him about things and he doesn't listen t. Waste any more of each other's time. I pushed upvote impulsively smiling face with tear. Do you really want to spend your life with someone who makes you feel like this? It might be time for some difficult decisions. Do him a favor and leave. Is this my wife? Should leave. Lemfow marriage is done in the West. And this is why I just smash hoes and I'll never get married tears of joy man face palming light skin tone. Ope. Same. Grimace. He's acted like a dick and destroyed your feelings for him. Are you still married? Did he act like a selfish child when you dated him? Can you give more context as well? Time to bail then. For both of your sakes. Life is short and you do not want resentment to seep in and start robbing you both of your joy. You did not mention kids so I presume that is not an issue. Your language suggests you may just need a good nap mom. Honey. Talk to him. Air your grievances. Try couples counseling. When all else fails divorce is a final option. I'm not one encourage anyone be so quick to go to that option though. Sometimes love with is a way. But if he's showing any signs of life. Maybe there's something left to build off of. 
probably should have thought about this before you decided to have a baby. You sound like quite the angel yourself. I mean marriage isn't all about love you're not a Disney princess. Oof. I don't know if there is any way to salvage this but maybe marital counseling is the best option. Be honest with the counselor and put it all on the table. What's he look like and what are you attracted to physically? You're a narcissist a gaslighter. Stop playing the victim. I'm sure the level of what you bring to the table could be best served up hot on a plate the size of a quarter. Unless he's actually abusive to you. Suck it up. Go to counseling and figure your shit out with him. You gave him your word. Till death do us part. Stop contributing to the disgusting divorce rate and fix your marriage. Bitching on a social media platform and having some people validate your opinion isn't going to do a thing for your relationship. If you have kids, stay with him and fulfill your marital duties. Do it for the kids. It doesn't matter. You made a vow. Love is about accepting a person totally and understanding that you always have to give more even. Though it is not fair. That is what love is. Service. But the trick is that both should service each other and not demand. Be a giver and not a taker. That is the compromise that creates a successful relationship. So tell him he needs to know I bet you will come to find out he thinks the same way about you. He just hides it better most men do. You know what you have to do. I recommend strengthening any other relationships you have before making the call it'll help to not isolate yourself. If you know you should go. My recommendation would be to seek out individual therapy as they can help you work through your personal feelings. If you still want to fight, you can try couples counseling. Either way, I wish you the best. Just curious, is it the looks, personality, or behavior that's causing the unattraction? I hate to see people unhappy. I also hate to see the divorce rate so high. Things are never going to be perfect all the time. Anytime my husband and I are in a rut, we take a vacation. But your partner needs to put in work too. How long have you been married for? Have you addressed this with him? Okay, cool. I don't believe that there was once something about him you liked. Have you ever thought it could be yourself that needs to change? Adapt and overcome too much splitting up in this world. Basically your respect level has dropped to zero at this point. Attraction level in a woman is a direct result of the level of respect they have for a man.